Sad day in Hollywood and for movie fans across the globe. That's right. Longtime mm -hmm. character actor Paul Sorvino, best known for his role as mob boss mm -hmm. Paul Cicero in Goodfellas, has died. CBS2 entertainment reporter Suzanne Marquez is here now with a look back at Sorvino's long mm -hmm. acting career. Suzanne. Juan and Susie, it's a heartrending day. It's yeah. sad, but it's mm -hmm. fun to look back at sure. all of his memories. Mm -hmm. Paul Servino also often played a quiet yet intimidating tough guy. He was the son of Italian immigrants, taught us all how to properly slice garlic. In real life, he was absolutely lovely. I interviewed him multiple times over the years, most memorably when he stood up for his daughter, actress Mira Sorvino, when it was revealed Harvey Weinstein blocked her from acting roles even after she won an Oscar. His death also comes two months after the passing of his Goodfellas co-star Ray Liotta. I'm not talking about what you did inside. Paul Sorvino was unforgettable in his role as Paul Polly Cicero in Martin Scorsese's Goodfellas. Hoover, why do you think Kissinger is taping all your calls? He played Henry Kissinger in director Oliver Stone's 1995 film Nixon. He played the quintessential tough guy. Unlike his characters, Paul Sorvino didn't mince words. For example, in 2018, when Golden Globe attendees wore black to support the Me Too movement, I interviewed him in Beverly Hills days before the Oscars. I'm an old timer. I don't think that these shows should be turned into platforms for political statements. It's not that it wasn't important to him. It's that he wanted action, a seismic shift in Hollywood culture. Reprehensible beyond description that women have been treated in this manner. The, the reality is that um, anyone who takes advantage of women should be publicly strangled, and I'll, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll volunteer. In 1995, his daughter Mira Sorvino won the Best Supporting Actress Golden Globe and the Oscar and dedicated her Academy Award to her father. When you give me this award, you honor my father, Paul Sorvino, who has taught me everything I know about acting. I love you very much, Dad. The tough guy exterior melted away. He was a puddle of tears. Normally, her career would have skyrocketed. Instead, she disappeared. It was later revealed that now disgraced studio head Harvey Weinstein blackballed her from Hollywood after she refused his advances. She's a great actress, one of the greatest actresses in the world. Mira deserves every um, opportunity she should have. Upon learning of her father's passing, Mira tweeted, My father, the great Paul Sorvino, has passed. My heart is rend asunder. A life of love and joy and wisdom with him is over. And he was the most wonderful father. I love him so much. I'm sending you love in the stars, Dad, as you ascend. Oh, the ultimate daddy's girl. We've lost so many great actors who play tough guy roles. Tony Sirico, who played another Polly in The Sopranos, of course. And Paul Sorvino's co-star in The Gambler, James Kahn. Paul Sorvino was 83 and Juan and Susie. You could tell what a big heart he uh, has, mm -hmm. right? He can, he can act like he's going to put a hit on somebody and then cry the next <laughs> yeah. second. Hey, 83 years old, lived a great yeah, life. And absolutely. like you said, so much fun looking back at yeah. some of his classic what roles. What a career he had. Suzanne. Yeah, we have Mira. Exactly. And her roles have started to come back clearly yeah. since Harvey was put away in prison, of course. Yeah. Yeah. I hope we see more of her. Thank yeah. you, guys. Suzanne, thank you.